All right, so here's an update of consoles um, slash you know, some new accessories, some new pickups. So I actually arranged this shelving system a little differently. Um, I'm kind of like in the way it looks now because it, in my other videos, you notice it was kind of like one shelf was you know, vertical, the other one's horizontal. So I just both put them horizontal so it gets more space and looks a lot better. So I'll run through the consoles. Uh, Panasonic 3DO, that's the SZ10 model. Um, you know, purchased at a, uh, I don't know, maybe in early 2000s. So I've had it for a while, but it's still like new condition. Uh, this is the FZ1 model, Panasonic 3DO. And if you guys remember the Panasonic 3DO that had a great port of Super Street Fighter 2 Turbo, probably one of the best ports today, um, especially for a CD based system. That is the Xbox One, nothing special about that. Um, I played that thing probably 20 times, got it new, and you know, just no need for it really, but uh, collector's items, you know, basically. Uh, Atari Jaguar, um, <laughs> console that flopped, just really didn't have a third party support, but it does look fabulous. Um, you know, that one, of course, is in light new condition. This is the uh, PC Engine Duo. Uh, most people remember the Turbo Graphics 16 or the Turbo Duo. So, you know, this one is modded pretty heavily and repaired. So, all caps replaced, CD ROM replaced, CD laser, I should say. Um, it also has a region mod in the back. If you can see that little switch, so I can play US games as well as the Japanese games. So, this one has, you know, the, the Hue card as well as the CD ROM. Uh, so really awesome console. That one's perfect. I mean, I probably put about $500 total uh, in that system. So um, I'm done with it and I'm not messing with it anymore. Next console is the Nintendo 8-bit. Did something a little different there. It has the um, painted white and just a black logo. So I kind of painted over the original logo. That's the Super NES. I believe that's the uh, second model, which is a smaller one. I have that modded so I can play uh, Japanese Famic Super Famicom games. This is the Nintendo 64, um, you know, kind of last cartridge based uh, console for Nintendo. PlayStation 1, that one's modded as well, has a mod chip and also, also has the Pro Action Replay. Uh, so it allows to play backups or uh, imports. Other console is the Sega Genesis 3, smaller. Genesis, but uh, works just as good as the other one. This is the Sega Saturn. I have a Pro Action Replay in there. It's it's not modded internally. I just support the Pro Action Replay, so I can play original Japanese games. So you know, not able to play backups on that console, and I'll I probably won't mod it to do that either. Uh, I wanted to keep everything original there. Sega Dreamcast. Um, you know, really no internal mods, but obviously the, the games you, you can make it backups and. Um, imports for those so you know pretty universal console um what do I have here oh PlayStation 2 slim model that one's modded um soft modded basically so I'm able to play PS1 PS2 you know backups imports whatever um it's got the free McBoot on there just some games here uh I got some Atari Jaguar Sega Genesis games PlayStation 2 games um and same thing here Sega Genesis, um, over there. Some other games here, Nintendo 64, um, got Super Game Boy, which is basically in like new condition. And all this stuff is really good. Um, so now to the uh, newer consoles. So I have a PlayStation 3 here. PlayStation 3. Uh, what's that? That's the Neo Geo X Gold. Got the two uh, joysticks for that. Of course, PlayStation 4 in the back, and that's that Retron 5 Awesome. I can play like Super Nintendo, Sega Genesis, Super Famicom games, Nintendo games, Game Boy Advance. So that's the system I use to play all the Nintendo games. It's got the emulation or whatnot, but it's still a great console. Uh, I sold my Wii, but I'm going to buy a Wii U. This is probably my newest accessory here that I picked up off of eBay. It's a PS2 joystick, which is awesome because... You know, I'm a big fan of fighting games, a big fan of joysticks, so if you guys seen my other videos, you know I collect these things. So my next purchase is the um, 
a Guilty Gear um, Mad Cat, so I'll have a PS4 one, and just great news because they announced the Street Fighter 5, I don't know when it's coming out, but it's going to be exclusive for the uh, PS4, so of course this is my PS3 stick, that's the Hori, I did a, you know, simple upgrade with the knob and some dust washers or whatnot, so uh, that's pretty much my collection right there, and you know, this is pretty cool here as well. This is the um, Persona 4, basically an arcade system. Um, kind of show you guys this. Basically Xbox in there, got speaker systems all around. So, um, Persona, basically playing Persona 4 right now. So, anyway, that's my updated collection. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please subscribe.